Causes are real, like I've been saying. To be caused is to be sentenced to demotion and inferiority. Welcome to today's DDRX. I've been talking about causes and we've been looking at sources of causes. I also have in the studio today uh, another guest. Her uh, name is Gifty. Welcome, Gifty. Thank you. What's your question? Uh, my question is what are the other sources of curses? Okay, uh, we have unscriptural covenants. Causes are real, like I've been saying. To be caused is to be sentenced to demotion and inferiority. To be caused is to have continuous sorrow. To be caused is to have everything work against you all the time. To be caused is to be constantly frustrated. So we have unscriptural covenant. God warned Israel about the nation whose land they were about to enter. They were all wicked, idolatrous nations. And God said to Israel in Exodus 22, 23, 32, you shall make no covenant with them, nor with their gods. And God meant it because God, if you make a covenant, which is a very solemn agreement with people who are under the power of evil forces, you come under the same power. So you need to watch out for secret cuts. You know, free ministry, for example, uh, in our community, we need to watch out. The cause of crippled, retarded, unhappy children may be as a result of covenant by parents or ancestors. So we are in covenant with the blood of Jesus. The Bible recognizes marriage covenant. Entering any other covenant can be dangerous. So we need to watch out who we associate with and be careful of possessing accursed things. You know, the Bible says, and you by all means abstain from the accursed things, lest you become accursed when you take up the accursed things and make the camp of Israel a curse and trouble it. So watch what you bring to your house or your homes in terms of curios, images, and idols, lest you create home for evil spirits and a cost. So the point is, you should always be vigilant uh, so that you don't get entangled. Let's say blessing together. I take authority over every accursed object that may have entered my house accidentally. I am free from every cause and locking evil spirit. It will have no effect over me. I undo the spells, incantations, charms, and evil plans against me. I plead the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' name, amen. <laughs>